Today, 2 and I are teaming up with some members of the Luminosity Gaming Academy in order to try and take down week four of the Fidelity Safe Room Challenge. Each week, the challenges get progressively harder and harder, and on the Fidelity server, they release three of them. Luckily enough, with this team behind me, I know we can make anything happen. Also, we're lucky enough to have the help of Fidelity Adam and Fidelity Alice in order to give us tips along the way. Let's do this. This is going to be so much fun for the week four of the Fidelity Safe Room Challenge. Now, guys, there's three separate challenges that we're going to have to do today. There's going to be one that's a parkour. Then after that, we're going to have to do a speed building challenge. And then finally, it's going to be all topped off with a dropper. Now, it's not going to be easy. And this parkour is going to be bigger than anything we've done yet. So good luck, everyone. Let's do it. Oh, no. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Ooh. Here we go to the week four area. So uh, pretty what? much, guys. It we oh. have to parkour up an entire what? building. Ugh. No that way. way. That's the parkour? Wait. Oh, yeah. Wait, where Go do we look. even do it, Jerome? Oh, no. Oh, wait. I, I think I see ladder. something over here. All right. Well, let's start climbing up these vines, guys. We got a long way to go. Look up. You see those clouds that keep going up and up and up? Oh, oh my, my goodness. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be us. Oh, I that just barely missed it. Oh, my gosh. All right. Let me try. Ah, hey, I nailed it. You made it. I feel like I Let's bumped go, you Jerome. up there with my head. You Goomba stuff. I made me. it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, I did not make it. I'm falling behind you, Jerome. All right. And oh, where oh, are my. you going? Um, I literally okay. slipped off, and I feel so su silly. Well, guys, I think that means it's probably about time we go to the Fidelity safe room and get some tips on parkour because... I need it. All right, let's see if Adam and Alice have any good tips for us to use. Look for blocks that can reduce your fall damage in case you slip on a ledge. Good advice, honestly. Alice said maybe you're scaling up the wrong building. Try another one. Also true. It'd be a shame if you were going the wrong direction. Don't forget to use the F5 key to see around corners. And how true that is. You can actually use that to see around corners in pretty much any game mode in Minecraft. It's so awesome. Take your time and don't get frustrated. This is a hard challenge, but if you stay calm and focused, you'll reach the end. Very true, Adam. And last but not least, Alice said change your FOV, field of vision, to help you see the challenge from a different perspective. Thanks for the advice, Adam and Alice. That was really good. Well, thanks, Adam and Alice, for giving us those tips. All right, let's go and let's climb to the top. Jeez. Yes. A drum, you can make it! All right, all right, all right. Tootie, oh my gosh, how many fire escapes oh, do I have drum? to go up to? Hi, oh, guys. Drum. I think it's this way. Let's go! Tootie, I totally didn't just try and push you off, by the way, in case drum, anyone asks. That it's okay. I'll, I'll believe you. I believe you. Oh, no. Mm. Oh, like that to this up here? No way. This isn't too Wait. difficult. I'm going to keep looking around this way. It's not this way, Jerome. And you guys seem to be having a real easy time climbing up there. I'm still on the first level. Don't worry. This you'll make it. it. Jerome, I think we have to make that jump. <laughs> Jerome, watch this. All you have to do is make this jump. No, I missed. Oh, oh wait. Oh, Jerome, I think you're supposed oh to that's right. There's here. no fall damage. Oh, yeah. Good point. <laughs> Drum, look, there's a bunch of seagulls over here. I bet we could parkour on top of the seagulls. Dude, should we try it? Yeah, Drum, jump on them. All right, guys, I think I know what I need to do. It's not going to be easy, though. Here we go. Yes! There wow. it is. No way. Drum, I think I can just make oh, this jump. I made it. Oh, okay, no. good luck, dude. That might be a bit far. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, no. Well, guys, I'm going to keep on going. Don't worry. I'll hold the torch for the team. As long no, as one of us beats it, we're all good. I believe I'll catch up to you. All right. Good luck, buddy. I'll tell you what. I can wait for all you guys at the top of this building here. All right. We have to jump across here now. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh no. No. One at a time. No. Ooh. Oh. no. Right. <laughs> How did your time work for you? And now we're taking a quick time out to share some words from our sponsor, Fidelity, on the smoothest way to trade stocks and ETFs. The Fidelity app. And when I say smooth, I'm talking Minecraft ice block smooth. So what makes investing with the Fidelity app so smooth? Well, there are $0 commissions when you trade any U.S. stock and ETFs. With no account minimums or fees. And with fractional shares, you could buy less than one share of a company, making it possible to invest with as little as $1. And to help you do the research, the Fidelity app features analyst ratings from a wide range of independent expert opinions into one simple score. With the Fidelity app, nothing comes between you and the trade. That's smooth. You can learn more at Fidelity.com or download the Fidelity app. But first, let's finish this minigame. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't tell me I have to strafe jump that. Oh, um, no. That's so hard. Oh, well, that was close. 
Yeah, that was a long way down. All right, here we go. Yes, nailed Yo, it. Yo, that's you, Jerome. All right, now I think I have to make it across to here. No. Ugh. Hey, there we go. Look at that. What a jump, Jerome. What a jump. I found the next ladder. Dude. Jerome, I'm right behind you. Let's go. We're making it big. We're making it big. Oh, there we can't can be that this, much Jerome. more left, right? Uh, actually, there definitely know. can be. I think oh, we have to go no. across to the clouds. Yeah, it works. You can jump on these clouds. Nice. I don't know. I don't trust these clouds. Well, you got to trust the clouds. All right. There we go. Let's keep moving and grooving. Oh, this Ooh. next jump is not going to be an easy one. Jerome, so believe. Let's go. Yes. He's an animal. Well done, Jerome. Yeah. All right. There's not much yeah. more of the clouds to go. All right. Let's keep moving, guys. We have a lot more clouds to parkour on. <sighs> Who? You know, I didn't think I'd be parkouring on clouds today. Yeah, well, you know what, Tootie? In the Fidelity Safe Room Challenge, anything's possible. You know what? That's right, Jerome. Okay, there's not much Ooh. left to do. I'm doing it. We can it. do this, Jerome. Jerome, just ladder. don't fall because then you go all the way down. All right, no one messed this up. Otherwise, we got to go all the way back. I made it. Good job. Nice, right. dude. Next, Jerome. Yes. Nice. Let's go, Tootie. No! Oh. <laughs> Drum, carry on my oh, team. No. Don't worry, Tootie. I'll carry on the torch for us, buddy. Dude, we are like literally at oh, cloud height we are right now. So high. There can't be much more to it. This has got to be towards the oh, end. Look at the blimp. Oh my gosh. Wait, I think that's what the build challenge is. I think we have to build our way over to that blimp. So that means that we're definitely going to be towards the end. Yeah, that's the end of the parkour challenge, I'm pretty sure. Let's go, Jerome! All right, guys, before we go for the speed build challenge, I think we need to go back to the Fidelity safe room to talk to Adam and Alice so we can learn a couple tips. All right, this next part is a speed bridge challenge, and we need some advice. Try changing your starting position to see if there's an area that allows for more accuracy. Not a bad idea. You don't want to start off on the wrong foot. His next suggestion is watch your step. Make sure to place the block before you take a step. Also true. Otherwise, you'll fall on down. Keep your finger on the shift key to make sure you don't fall off the edge. Definitely, if you're holding shift, you're not going to fall off any ledge in Minecraft. Tapping the shift key and placing blocks under you is called speed bridging. Why not give it a shot? It's very true, but also very hard. But Alice is right. If you can master that, you'll be the fastest builder in town. And last but not least, stay focused. This challenge can be tougher than expected. However, if you keep your cool, you can surely beat it. Thanks for the encouragement, Alice. Bye, everybody. Oh, this is gonna be so good. All right, guys, we'll race to get to the bottom of the blimp. Let's do it. Oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Dude, I like the way you think, easy. friend. Yeah, eventually you gotta build up. We're definitely not at the right height. But keep in mind, some of the clouds you can walk on, some you fall through. So be careful. Yo, what you do. Oh, do. Dude, no, 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 come on. We think about it. We can talk about it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my right. gosh. <laughs> Here. Let's work together. Wait, wait. Let's work together. You build oh, out my here, side. I'll build here. out your side. Oh, Drew, oh, you bumped uh, me. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Well, that's oh, what no. you get, Avery, for trying to um, use my bridge. No. Avery, is that you on the other side there? Sandrum! Sandrum! Oh, my gosh, Tootie. Oh. Bye. Goodbye, guys. I like that cloud. Oh, no. Well, that's fortunate. I think I'm going to make it over first. Drum. Let's see. I did it. Yeah, oh, look at that. man. Easy oh. speed build challenge. But don't worry, guys. The last challenge is about to start, and it's a dropper, so it's anyone's game. I, I want to know. I climbed out of that snow. It wasn't oh, wow. You take actually me. did. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'm going to jump down first for the challenge. Here we go. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I, I think I overshot. I no! missed it so bad. Oh, I'm close. Oh. Oh. You know what, guys? I think if we're going to nail this, we're going to oh, need no. some tips from our friends of Fidelity. Let's go talk to Adam and Alice in the Fidelity safe room. All right, let's see if Adam and Alice have any suggestions for the dropper. Adam said, make sure to change your field of vision, as this will allow you to zoom in and out to see different routes. Very true. Alice said, sometimes the alternate route is the better option. Don't be afraid to experiment. Honestly, very true, Alice. Adam said, try to stand at the top and make a game plan before you jump to save time. I like that idea a lot. Game plans are always a good idea. Adam said, pressing slash holding the shift key in the air will make you go even faster. I didn't know that, but that's really good advice. Try using your increased momentum to your advantage by making quick cuts. Not a bad idea at all, Alice. Thanks for the advice, Adam and Alice. All right, well, with those tips, I bet you were going to be able to do it. Let's start moving. <gasps> Let's go. Let's go. I made it. Ooh, let's go. Whoa. Whoa. Nice. You guys nailed that. And I, I missed and then I fell through the cloud. 
I did it too. Let's go. Let's go, hey. Jerome. GG. Well, guys, that was another awesome week of the Fidelity Safe Room Challenge. If you all had fun, then do me a big favor and try out the server for yourself down below in the description. On top of that, thank you for watching. And thanks, of course, to Fidelity for sponsoring this video.